Good afternoon. Um, last weekend, the Raider Robotics teams participated in uh, FLL's North Alabama Qualifier. FLL is a program dedicated to um, getting kids interested in science and technology. Each year, teams are given a theme that has to do with the problem facing the community. This year's theme was Senior Solutions, which is problems having to deal with the aging community. These problems are selecting the correct medicine bottles or forgetting to turn off the oven. During tournaments, teams are judged in four areas, robot game, project presentation, technical design defense, and um, project pre teamwork and core values. During the robot game, teams build autonomous robots, which they program to do various missions on a field. They have two and a half minutes com to complete these missions. A team of judges gives each competing team an independent challenge to solve to see how well they work together. Challenges range from raising a milk jug with paper clips to building the longest Lego bridge. This year, each team was asked to create a new story with each team member adding three words at a time. The team is then required to justify the design of their robot. During this segment, teams are allowed to run any programs or missions they choose to. Teams are also scored on effective and innovative ideas of their robot design. The final area in which teams are judged is project presentation. Each year, first LEGO League teams are charged with researching a problem that today's scientists and engineers are trying to solve, come up with an innovative solution to that problem, and share their findings in a five-minute presentation. We are excited about our big idea this year in Senior Solutions. First, we talked with some of the senior members of our family and we came up with two primary issues. The first of these, these issues being that having worked so hard for most of their lives, most seniors are finding themselves extremely bored. Seniors find it difficult to keep up with the rapidly growing changes in technology. We've explored various ideas and thought that it would be a good idea to model our project after the Generations United program. Generations United is an organization that is committed to improving the lives of children, youth, and adults through intergenerational collaboration. We are working with Randolph's community director um, department and we are going to, in January, establish an intergenerational network that will include support, support groups and mentoring opportunities. And we will do this by starting a technology workshop for seniors. And we feel that this workshop will help solve the two main problems that we discovered by um, keeping it seniors entertained and also helping them learn about new technology. Last weekend, the Rando Ro Raider Robotics Blue Team went to the qualifier for Northern Alabama, and we got first in robot game and third in presentation. <laughs> and we would like to thank our coaches, Ms. Hansen, Ms. Simmons, and Mr. McFarlane. 